What's up guys, I'm Phoenix Master 1 and welcome back for some more Fire Emblem Heroes. And this video is gonna be a bit of a spoiler, so if you don't wanna get spoiled about the new Legendary Hero that's coming out next week, then you should click off this video and uh, you should just uh, keep in mind that you might get spoiled on Twitter or Instagram. So just be careful. And this revelation is not for the people with feeble hearts, so uh, just grab onto something because this is gonna be really surprising. And our next Legendary Hero is gonna be Roy. Yeah, so if you saw the Google Play Store, uh, then you can see that it says that Legendary Roy, Blazing Lion is going to be here. And Roy doesn't really have a Blazing Lion as any of his titles, so we can say that it's not uh, one of the existing Roy's with just a wrong title. So it's definitely going to be Legendary Roy if they're not just pranking us. So yeah, he's going to be the next Legendary Hero, probably going to be a Fire Hero, of course. If he's not gonna be a fire hero, then I don't know what to say. So if he's gonna be a fire legendary hero, then he's gonna be having the defense as his legendary boost because we already have other fire legendary heroes for the other stats. Um, and I'm guessing that he's gonna be an infantry sword unit. We already have like a million of those, but I mean, Roy doesn't really have many options. He could be a cavalry version of himself, but uh, a great lord, uh, Roy is probably more likely, I think. With some kind of improved version of Binding Blade because Binding Blade is not really all that powerful compared to how it is in his own game. So let me know in the comments how you feel about this. Personally, I'm really happy that he got this Legendary Alt because it was going to be happening sooner or later. I mean, this is as surprising as getting a 3-star bot tray on a Greenstone. It was going to happen eventually. And uh, this means that he's not going to be getting an alt on the Binding Blade banner which comes out on uh, March. I think 8th of March. So that's really nice. I hope that there are no alts on the Binding Blade banner because there are many amazing Binding Blade characters that they can introduce in that banner. Uh, so Roy being a legendary hero right before that actually makes it even better. I'm just surprised how these kinds of things can just leak uh, from a company like Intelligent Systems. Like so many times, we also had the Nino banner leaked for and many things leaked before as well like the uh, blessings for Ether raids. So, I guess Intelligent Systems were an indie development team all along. So yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, then please be sure to leave a like. And if you haven't already, then make sure to subscribe for more Fire Emblem Heroes content. And please be sure to hit that notification bell so that you can get the updates to my videos. Because it seems like even YouTube is being run by Intern Kun. So, with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. And have a great day.